Alright you guys, well, I was asked to do a cooking video, so I'm going to do one. I'm making my family fried chicken drums, and I'm making myself stuffed cream cheese bacon wrapped jalapenos for dinner. I'm also making them macaroni. I'm making me broccoli and I'm making them green peas. So, you guys, I put my, let me show you what I did. Hold on. So, yes, you see my chicken seasoned with ranch, mustard, seasonings, lots of them, in the sink. That's how I do it. I let it marinate for a little bit. And then I go ahead and put it in my flour that's seasoned. And then I fry it. So let's get to it. All right, guys. So right now I'm going to turn the cold water on, and I'm gonna lightly do this. That's it. And spread a little bit of water on the chicken. Okay. Let me turn the light on. Did that make it better? Okay. So now I'm going to whisk this chicken around, honey. Just like so, just to mix it all up and get all the seasonings all around. Just to make sure it's real good. Okay, so this is what it looks like before I dunk it. Look at all them seasonings. So now I'm going to dunk it. I'm going to take my fork and cover him. I'm going to pat him a little bit. And then I'm going to pick him up. Turn him over. Do it again. And then I put him in there. So I pick up the next piece. And do the same thing. Everybody says they always want to see how I cook, so here it is. You don't have to see my face. You know it's me. You know it's me, girl. So this is what I do. If I want it extra crispy, I dip it in a uh, egg wash, but I really don't. I just want it to be like it is. As you can see, there's seasoning already in the chicken. I season my food like really, really, really season it. So if you're not a person that really likes seasoning, I don't use uh, salt for myself, but I do for, I use seasoning salt for my family. I'm from the south and I grew up cooking in the kitchen with using the sink so if you guys think that's not okay just know I bleach my sink before I use it and if I want extra flavor I go back in with some of this good stuff right here and put it back in the flour Yeah, I'm on a diet so I can't eat what my family eats, but I love to make my family happy and I love when they like my food, so it matters to me that it tastes good. So while my chicken is cooking, I'm going to go ahead and cut my... A jalapeno peppers so I can make them stuffed. I need to take the seeds out of them. These are big ones. So I will cut all the little yellow pieces out. And I will wash them out to make sure there's no seeds left behind because I don't want them hot. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<coughs> to where they're like, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> to where they're like this. I think I got some jalapeno juice in me. So I will continue to cut all of these and do them the same exact way and hopefully not cut my fingers off because that would be bad. But I take out all the yellow part because I believe that's what he is. So I'm going to finish cutting these and I'll come back when it's time to wrap them. Okay, so these are all cut. Next step, I'm browning some ground turkey. I mean, I'm browning some ground turkey, and then I'm going to put ground turkey and cream cheese and wrap these in bacon. That'll be the next step that you see. All right. <laughs> All right, you guys, so I'm done with my chicken, my fried chicken. And here it is. Here's how the chicken turned out. Shiki, 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 shiki. You don't see it? I'll pick up a piece so you can see. Here is my shiki. My shiki, shiki, bok, bok. It's flaky. So, I cooked all the chicken. It's done. Now, I am fixing to mix my ground turkey that I cooked with some of this cream cheese. So that way I can go ahead and put it in the stuffed jalapenos. So I'm going to stuff my jalapenos with this ground turkey that I've seasoned and cooked and cream cheese. And then I'm going to wrap them with bacon and put them in the oven and let them cook. I don't want this milky, but I want it, you know, to where it's all mixed. Where it's not just a bunch of cream cheese, not just a bunch of meat. They're eating the chicken and the macaroni and the peas and I'm gonna have this bacon wrapped cream cheese uh, ground turkey filled jalapenos with broccoli on the side because I am in full effect on my diet so y'all make sure y'all try this and tell me how you like it baby See, I don't want just big clumps of the uh, cream cheese, so I'm trying to work through it and make sure there's no big clumps of it. That way it can all be mixed. And now I'm going to fill them. I don't want to fill them up too, too much because it makes it harder to wrap them and stuff. So, some of them are deeper, so some of them will have more. So I will be filling them all. All of them will be filled with the ground turkey and cream cheese. And then I will wrap them with bacon. And then I will cook them on 350. All right, you guys, so the moment you've been waiting for, they are stuffed. Now it's time to wrap them. They are filled with ground turkey meat, 
seasoned of course I seasoned it with cream cheese mixed together and I'm about to wrap them in bacon so stay tuned all right you guys now I cut my bacon in half so I'm gonna simply like just wrap them around I don't like it when it's one big strip I like them when they're cut in half because I don't like the whole thing like full of bacon So just like this, and I'm going to do them all like this. So I'm just going to wrap them with the bacon. Then I'm going to put them in the oven. I don't like the whole thing wrapped with bacon. Some people do, some people don't, but I don't. I'd rather have... You know, some in between that's not. So it's still like one full piece of bacon wrapped around it. I just do mine how I like them. And that's how I do them. I'm going to be making a mukbang with these, so stay tuned for that too, because you will see me do my mukbang with these peppers. So how do you guys do yours? Do you do yours something similar to this? Or no? I don't want to put another piece of bacon on that one. And I'll show you when they're done. Okay, so now they're done. I'm going to put them in the oven. Oven time. Alright, you guys. This is the finished product with my jalapenos. Bacon wrapped stuffed jalapenos. And let me show you hubby's plate. This is the final finale. And that's it guys. Cooking with me. Hope you enjoyed it. I hope y'all enjoyed everything that I showed you. And if you want me to do certain things, let me know.